Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel, or if you're new, hi there, my name is Lou. Um, so, this video is starting off as me talking about the video, if that makes sense. Um, a few months ago I got to do, well in summer, it's now winter, I, I got to shoot an amazing campaign with an amazing skincare brand called Augustine Bada. Augustine Bada is a professor, he is so lovely, I actually got to meet him and talk to him um, and I, I got to shoot the campaign with six other amazing people. We all had different skin types, different ages and different stories as into why we would were chosen for the campaign. I was the youngest and I was the only one who had acne and scarring. Um, everyone had, there was a DJ called Mimi who's amazing, there's a plus size model Jenna who again is insane, she's a babe. There's a model who is in her 70s called Jan who's been gracing the covers of Vogue since like the 60s. Um, an Olympic athlete called Alex Gregory, who was an English rower for the Olympics. Um, Eric Underwood, who was also in the, who was also a ballerina. And I think I miss, am I missing? Any? And Elizabeth Day, who is an amazing author. So we all had different stories, different skin types, and the whole point was kind of like an experiment. Over 27 days, we used the cream. There's two different types of cream. There's the cream or the rich cream. I used the cream because it's for like younger skin. Um, the rich cream is thicker for like older skin. Um, and we basically had our face scanned every time we were there. We had a microscopic camera which was filmed by an amazing videographer who actually worked with Dave Attenborough on Blue Planet. His name is Richard Kirby. Then there was like a behind the scenes documentary by and a director who was an Emmy nominated filmmaker called Sophie. She also has done a documentary that's on Netflix, which is amazing. So it was an amazing team along with the photographer who is a Vogue Beauty photographer, hair and makeup, but also insane. Everybody was absolutely amazing, so it was obviously such an amazing opportunity. Um, and it was so honest, it was so real. I didn't wear a single bit of makeup the entire campaign, which was insane, because I've always wanted to do something with no makeup on to show my skin and acne and to kind of preach for us acne people out there. Um, but I did a little bit of a behind the scenes video so you guys could see what happened. Also gonna put up the image here which explains um, what happened to my skin over the time and what is one of the campaign pictures. So it definitely, definitely, definitely helped with my redness. It totally helped it calm down. My skin was so hydrated and moisturized, I cannot even explain it. The cream is so amazing. Um, I really think you should go watch the documentary because it literally shows so much more. It tells you so much about more about the cream in depth than what I can say to you right now. All of the specialists, all of the people who are in the documentary are also people in the campaign. Professor speaks about it. You'll learn so much more by watching it. It's not very long and it really is insightful and it's very interesting. It was a, it was a very interesting experiment to be a part of, so I'm very grateful for that. Um, so before I show the rest of the video, I'm just going to show you the cream. Ha ah, ha! This is the cream, isn't the packaging absolutely beautiful and amazing? Yes, it is. The best part is, it's a magnet. I know. I know. I know it sounds really weird, but packaging and things is amazing. This is the cream. It's very beautiful packaging. This is like the original first one that came out. This is the cream. Um, and as I said, there's also the rich cream. And this one is a 50 milliliters, which lasts you more than the 27 days. I swear this would last you like two months. You do two pumps, once in the morning, once in the evening. Um, it's also really good before your makeup. It like creates a really nice, clean base, um, moisturized, hydrated base before your makeup. So this is the 50 milliliter one. I also have this one, little blue one, again, still beautiful packaging. Um, this is the 30 milliliter one, and if I'm not mistaken, I'm pretty sure there is a new size, which I think is 15 milliliters, but I'm just going to double check for you guys. 
yes yeah, so there is now also a 15 milliliter one as well so you can get little mini ones that you can travel with which is amazing so there are three sizes there are two different types of creams um i will leave all of the links below for you guys to one watch the documentary which you should it's amazing two obviously the website of um the cream um and their socials and things like that down below and also some of the amazing people involved like the ma my makeup artist on shoot mj who has a youtube channel herself um she uses vegan and cruelty free makeup products beauty products she's the nicest person ever and she's also preaching an amazing preach herself so i will leave links to her below but here we go here is my behind the scenes of augustine beta um it's a campaign thank you guys so much and enjoy Pick up on your no, tips, Diego. Diego. Your secrets. No. Diego secrets. Yeah, Copyrighted. I have more. I have more tips in mind. <laughs> He's gonna write book. Yeah. How to style using one <laughs> balloon. How to style an entire barnet using one balloon. I love that word, barnet. Louisa, we love you. Yeah, we love you. We love you. We love Louisa. you. Louisa. the best. Everyone. <laughs> we are her biggest fans. 
and they get I to work. With her. I'm a biggest fan. No, no, I am. But the best thing is we get to work um, with her. Really two times a week at the minute. At least. Yeah. <laughs> I have been able to touch my brushes on Louise and all Oh, come follow me. That's better, better lighting, isn't it? I'm Louise's biggest fan, and today I get to work with her for the last time, which is really sad. But there she is. Yeah, or even that. Glowing. Yeah, yeah, that can help. Yeah. Um, and go follow me if you'd like to. I've got a channel called Plant Face on YouTube uh, and we get to talk about vegan and culture free makeup. Mm. Shameless. <laughs> it's my vlog now. 